Well, I think in a lot of ways, you know, with the press conferences that the Fed does every six weeks these days, um, there's a lot of communications, a lot of what is being said is being repeated and reemphasized, which is, you know, the basic story is uh, the economy is doing pretty well uh, from a growth perspective. Inflation's coming down. It's still a little too high um, from the Fed's perspective. And they need to get, you know, they need to get more confident in inflation being durably beat before they start uh, an interest rate cutting cycle. And so, um, you know, the fact that cuts might be on the horizon is uh, is certainly a positive, particularly for financial markets. And we're seeing that broadly the last couple of days. Um, but you know, the data has to come through in order to give the Fed confidence yeah. to do the cuts that many are hoping for. What are your thoughts on that, Bob? Is, is inflation, is the cap back on the inflation bottle? Well, I think I think most people living in their day to day would would certainly have a bone to pick with the idea right. that inflation is beat. Um, and, uh, you know, the Fed follows this, the, the a certain set of data. And what I'd say there is that it's, it's obviously quite meaningfully improved since where we were, you know, when inflation was running at nine or 10 percent uh, on a year over year basis. But it certainly doesn't look totally beat. I think there's a real risk when you look at the the data and the dynamics going on that we get inflation that kind of settles in the sort of three to four range rather than in the one to two range, which is what the Fed's targeting. Right. Um, and you know some of the things that have been such a support to bringing inflation down, slowing inflation, like you know falling gas prices as an example, going from five bucks a gallon to three bucks a gallon. Well, now that's creeping back up, and that flows into other other prices throughout the economy. And so I think there's reasons to believe that it may not be totally beat. 